Hi everyone, it's Matt here from Greatness Every Day and in this video, I'm really excited to share with you how to form better habits using something called the pointing and calling method. And it's a really simple method, it's quick and easy to use, but I really believe it's going to help you identify the habits that you have because if we're being honest, we could very easily be able to tell our friends or our family or a coworker some of the good habits that we have and some of the negative habits that we have. But I'm going to argue that there are just as many habits that we are unaware of. Uh, they might be good, they might be bad, they might have no influence on us at all, but there's so many habits that we might be unaware of that we have that can really make a big difference once we identify them. And so what we're doing with the pointing and calling method it's very simple. All you do is you point to the habit that you're doing and you call out the action that you're doing. You call out that habit you're doing. For example, I'm making my bed right now. That's one example of that. At the same time, you're elevating that habit that you have, whether it's good or bad or neutral, whatever, you're elevating that habit from the unconscious where you're unaware of it into the conscious where you know what habits you have. And by doing this, once you know the habits you have, you can work to create the vision that you have for your life. You can work to say, these are my positive habits. I want to do more of these positive habits, or these are my negative habits. I want to do less, or if not eliminate them entirely from my life. So by pointing and calling, it's a very simple and easy method that you can use to become aware of the habits you have again, so that you can change your life and you can change your habits that you, that you do whether you realize it or not and create the vision that you're working towards. So uh, an example of this would be really easily, my morning routine is something that I talk about a lot, right? For me, I'm able to go through my morning routine and do a quick example here of pointing and calling. So the very first thing is I wake up, I point to my bed and I say out loud, I'm making my bed right now. And then from there, I walk into the washroom. I'm able to point and say, I'm using the washroom right now. And then I go into my power hour, my 20 minutes of exercise, my 20 minutes of getting my gratitude journal out, my 20 minutes of listening to an audiobook. By going through my morning, I'm pointing and calling out the habits that I have. And so far, if I'm being honest, those habits are what I would view as positive habits. But Maybe I go through the rest of my morning routine and it comes to my breakfast time and I sit down and I say, I'm taking out the sugariest cereal that I have in my house and eating that, right? Is that a good habit? No, by identifying that, I'm able to really become aware of the decisions that I'm making and bringing that again from the unconscious into the conscious. And then from there, it's ultimately my choice. Do I choose to eat this sugary cereal or do I choose to put it away throw it in the garbage and eat something that would be much better for me. So that is a quick example of pointing and calling uh, demonstrated. I'm going to show you another example right now, uh, me preparing to go for a run. By pointing and calling, I'm able to very clearly understand the habits that I'm doing, what I'm about to partake in, and at the same time making that choice because now I've identified the habits that I have. Do I do this or do I not? So watch this. If you have any comments, let me know in the comment section below and I'd love to start the conversation. All right, so today is a beautiful day. It's a beautiful fall day and I'm getting ready to go for a run. So I thought this was a great way to illustrate the pointing and calling method where just to review, you point out the habit that you're doing and you verbally say it out loud as well. So as I get myself ready, the very first thing that I'm going to throw down are my running shoes, and I call those out. I'm adding my running shoes. Next, I'm gonna add my running shirt. Now my running shorts. Now my chocolate bar. And now my keys. Which one of those habits as I go through verbally is the negative habit? Well, there's the chocolate bar and I choose to decide to keep that or to get rid of it. So that is my video on pointing and calling. It's a really easy and efficient method that you can use to form better habits. So if it helped, please click the thumbs up button, subscribe to our channel and follow us on Instagram for daily inspiration and encouragement to live a great life. You can also visit our website at www.gr8nesseveryday.com. Thanks again, and remember, choose greatness every day.